The Black Magic Ursa Broadcast G2 offers not only a Super 35 inch sensor, 13 stops that amp range, and 6K resolution up to 50 frames per second, it also offers the ability to use this camera in a multi cam situation. This is kind of a first, really, for Black Magic to have a high caliber, high resolution camera that's not a smaller sensor, or really the original broadcast camera, which was only okay. This is a much better version, and 6K definitely helps. I took this camera out and I wanted to take it through some of the paces that I found highlighted the problems in the original broadcast camera and that is that zoomed in sensor, the cropped in sensor for the you know TV aspect ratio, that smaller kind of essentially super 16 size slice of the sensor. I took this camera out and I shot a bunch of video of my backyard with birds and I wanted to test how this camera did with the cropped sensor. When you use the crop sensor, it's when you need to use the television type of zoom that, that B4 mount, you know, news camera for zoom. And usually, like many of us have noticed on other cameras, is when you do the crop sensor, the 6K, Super 16 size crop sensor, that we can really see the deficiencies in the design. So in the past camera, the original version of the broadcast, we struggled at even medium ISOs. And you could see a lot of noise and fixed pattern noise and grain everything else. With this version, you can crop in and those artifacts are mostly missing. This really comes down to the fact that this camera has this 6K dual native ISO sensor that helps people jump up to 3200 from 400 and get a really nice clean image even when you are using just a fraction of the sensor frame. So all in, I found this camera to be fun to shoot. I feel like the colors look great. It's an inexpensive camera. It's a camera that schools, universities, and churches can use and teach both the news style gathering with the filmmaking kind of you know education with the super 35 inch sensor. You can change the lens mount so easily. You can go from B4 to Canon EF to Nikon to PL. You have a camera that has just a lot of options and that means you can use it in so many different ways. All in, I kind of think Blackmagic kind of hit this one on the nail ahead. 